Hey guys, welcome to my channel. You're probably new if you're not one of my 21 subscribers, so I'll introduce this video. I'm gonna be dyeing my hair. So this is what it looked like after I got it cut. So like my first ever video was when I cut all my hair off for Brad Mondo. And then this is what I want it to look like, so that's the plan. Okay, dyeing my hair blue before we're moving during the pandemic. All right, so I know I look a little crazy right now because my roots have grown in. As you can see, I don't think I filmed the last, maybe I did, I don't know. This is the color it is. So we're gonna do all over blue today with the rest of the Arctic Fox that I have. That's like some of this color, what it was. And like there's so many different variations in my hair right now that it's all gonna look good with the blue all over it. It's gonna look like different, like I tried. It's gonna be like highlights, lowlights. It's also really short now. Oh, since I cut my hair, yes, that was the last update. I went and got it fixed. <laughs> and this girl gave me like a like a pixie kind of, she just kind of like layered what I had already done. And because this side was higher than this side. Oh, that would make such a nice paper. That makes it art still oh. while I was Oh, look at that nub! The scissors didn't really catch it or for whatever reason. Mm -hmm. So, it's it fine. Better, like, Having a crisis. But honestly, it's not that bad of a crisis. She's going to teach us how to texture it. And it's, it's going to be fine. It's supposed to look like this. It actually doesn't look that bad yet. Like, I'm going to fix it. Fine. I don't need a hairdresser, Brad. We went for like an inverted bob, like pixie punk rock thing. So like, yeah, I got what I wanted, but I'm not happy about the color now because my roots are like gross. And this part of my hair never took in the first place. And I was like, oh, I'll fix it. But then I never did. So today is the day, it's been about a month. I'm moving out of my house or my apartment. So Literally, this is the only thing in the bathroom, and this is why I'm doing it now, because I don't want to get blue hair dye in my new house. We're gonna strap on the gloves. This will be an easy one, because I'm not bleaching. So I don't need to be careful, because I've decided to leave my roots alone. I'm not even looking at the bleach. Not. <laughs> I just, I kind of just want to let it chill and just put some temporary dye in for a bit. You know, it'll be good. So, I'm going to brush it out. Yeah, when the roots, like, with this color, with dark hair, like, the roots just kind of make it look greasy right now. Because, like, it's all that dark coming in under, like, the platinum blonde. Like, my ends are faded to, like, nothing of a blue. Like, some of them are just, like, silverish gray. Which is, like, cool. I enjoyed it for a hot minute, but, like... I only let it get so faded and it's grown out, so. I guess we can section this. Brad Mondo would yell at me if I didn't. I have found that it is, I forgot how hard it was to do your hair when it's short. And I don't think I've ever had this, like when it was short this time last year and it was blue, It. I don't think it was this short or maybe I didn't have as many layers in it. Yeah, because we did it at home, I had no layers. So yeah, okay, this is what we're working with. Okay. Mm -mm -mm. How's everybody's pandemic? <laughs> if you ever see this during the pandemic, we're just going in. All right, we get a bunch on there and we get our trusty hair dye toothbrush. And I feel like I should have sectioned a little more than this, but like, we're just gonna go in and like mush it around. Oh, I forgot to put the jelly on my face and ears so they don't get stained. I love Arctic Fox because it smells good and it like doesn't burn your eyes when you're dying. Like it's a semi-permanent dye. It's not gonna hurt your hair. Like it's just, if anything, like it just, and you can do whatever. They have so many colors and you can mix the colors to make other colors. I need to put this stuff on my face or I'm gonna it's already covered in hair dye. This is the only thing I, I used to use this for tattoos, but I haven't gotten a tattoo in a while. So I just keep using it for when I'm hair dyeing and I realize that I don't have Vaseline. 
But I think it's the same shit. Aquaphor. I think I've seen people use it. Okay, let's get that all out there. We don't want. Okay. I always do this thing where I get it in my hair too. So Brad Mondo, tell me, does that like cancel out whatever I'm trying to dye there? Is that why I get patches that won't dye? Okay. While we're talking about these patches, let's just get them. Let's go in on those so we know that they are covered. Because they have bothered me. Ooh. Ooh. This is gonna be blue. I missed the blue. I did the purple on top for a hot minute or for a while and I just haven't dyed my hair. Like the world's been crazy. I just haven't had time. Well, I have had time. I've just been watching Netflix and not wanting to do it. But then I realized, oh, I love, I feel better when I have a fresh coat of paint on. I might take the sections and make them into little ponytails like I used to, because that was easier to control. Okay, I packed all of my little elastics, but I found three in my room. So this should be interesting. Oh, there's some right there. Okay, so we're gonna take all the front. Okay, I guess we're just moving in this section of my head, because that's what I decided to do. Let's get a little bit up here. Ooh, just right on the hair. Just fucking. I know you like that, Brad. So my ends are so dry that like that is just like that brushing it through just to the end is just enough that it's going to pick up all that pigment and it's going to be blue again how do you put an elastic on with gloves like <clears throat> i'm gonna wear my hair like i love i'm with the short hair though i am loving like the tiny little buns you can make them perfect oh once it gets a little bit longer, it'll be perfect. It's like super faded. Like some of it's like piss yellow now, I think. Or maybe that's just my imagination, but. I saw an opening and I took it. I'm gonna go and learn cross-eyed from looking like this, looking this way. Oh, I just got a big gob on my face. Sure. All right, I guess this is a hair dyeing cloth now. We Gucci. Everything's fine. The world isn't ending. We're just freshening our hair. We didn't cut our hair and dye it because the world was ending. No, no, no. We weren't already a colored hair girl. We're just freshening up and it's fine. And this is therapy. And this is how we get through hard times like this. And I know it's hard. Is that a big enough section? It's like hella blonde by my ear. Cause I don't think I even got that in the first place. Cause I think I was rushing to do it right before my party or something. Yeah, I dyed my hair like the day of my birthday party. Like February 8th. Okay, but did y'all see Joanna Cedia fucking shave her head? I was dead. She looks like a model now. 
like what the heck would happen to our little high schooler protege okay don't get any dye on your face or in your mouth oh, we have so much hair left Okay, let's do this middle section that seems to want to be out anyway. So this section, right, I'm gonna cut it in half. And I can't see what I'm doing, so y'all are gonna have to help me. Okay, we'll cut it in half and then pour it right on my head. Oh, I can see that. Yeah, buddy. It's a good amount. And now for this section, I think we're just gonna have to use our hands. Honestly, the dark roots with the dark blue is gonna look a hell of a lot better. I look better with dark hair. And then we're gonna go in with the toothbrush just for those roots, because I can't see them and I don't want blonde roots. Especially when they're grown out roots. Get out of here with that bullshit. Can y'all see? Am I doing it? Am I doing it? Scalp's a little blue. Can't be helped. Now we're gonna hit the ends. Looking like a blue alien. Oh. Alex added in some uh, alien noises right here. Oh. I came out of bear 51. Do we think it's blue? Trumpet playing, I learned how to whistle. Oh god, that's still half my head. This is the part where everybody gives up and I can't give up. Okay, we're gonna cut it down the middle. Perfect, two more elastics, two more sections. Ooh, got this. All right. We're almost there. So we're gonna do the same thing as the last section because it worked really well. I can't see anyway, so y'all may as well see. Ooh. Depth perception, I'll fail me now. Did that work? I think I need more dye. Saturate it a little more because it is sucking up all of it. Like I can see it. And this is the part where I'm gonna turn it turns blue. enough dye this is perfect how perfect can life be right now see everyone needs to be grateful that we have the time to get back to life off work like most like i know that there's people struggling but like if you're able to get on ei and like survive for a little bit like ride it out like you'll make more money in your life you're never gonna get these big days back it kind of makes me sad sometimes that people are all stressed and like some people are being so negative to, like these days and it's just unnecessary the whole world is going through the same shit. 
so like just be nice to people and we'll all get through this follow public health safety mandatory things now in nova scotia just stay inside ride it out more people are gonna get sick because of the last couple weeks like just because people are getting sick doesn't mean it's not working isolation social distancing it will work we just all need to give it a fair shot so that it can that's my two cents on that if this video isn't up until after quarantine's done then i hope you all had a great quarantine and spent your time wisely i know i haven't been i've just been watching netflix but it was a good rest it was a good rest and i am still working part-time to fill shifts in the group homes that i work in because that's an essential service but i've definitely been feeling more rested feeling like more excited about what's to come like life will go on after this virus i'm just getting my little baby hairs in the back probably turning my neck blue but that's fine mush it in there Did I do it? Am I done? Did I cover it all? The elastic has morphed into my hair, but it's fine because we're gonna put the cap on. After we washed off the gloves, cause they're reusable. And we dry it on the towels that we're gonna throw out anyway. I've never been so excited to move in my life. This building is trash. I've had a good time living here, but like the building is trash. Nothing has been repaired since we moved in and our house is so perfect. I'm just excited. Ew, there's bleach in it. And it's a little bit wet, so any heat will create. Well, not really the semi permanent on They said I could heat it if I wanted to. Like blow dry it on top of it. All right, and now we go. How did we get so much on our fingers? I literally touched nothing. Why am I blue? Oh, my life. Gonna let this sit for 45 maybe. Just let it really soak into that dry ass hair. I'll rinse it out and I'll check back to see how it is. If I need to touch up any spots, I guess I might do that. I'm really hoping I don't have to though. Cause I don't want to. Avoid as much damage as possible. Clean up before you let process because it's just gonna stain your skin even more. Like even with the jelly, you need to wash it off or it's gonna spread to the parts that you didn't get it on. Gamer helping gamer too. I'm gonna go watch some Netflix and wait to rinse this out. So it's 1.30 now. I don't know how long it's been in. I watched the last of Madame CJ Walker, however long that episode was, and then I started watching something else. Okay, time to rinse it out. Uh, I don't know how to do that on video, I've never done this, so I'll see you when it's rinsed. Just kidding, I really don't take the elastic. Oh, I see some purple left in here. How'd you, how'd you survive? All right, whatever. A little bit of purple didn't hurt anybody. Elastics are out. Now I'm gonna rinse. I need a towel. Perfect, one that already has stains on it. Okay, so I'm gonna move all my moving boxes so that I rinse my hair out. Maybe I'll try and film it. Why not? Okay, so we're gonna, Why is it 
that blue never runs clear. I've been down here for a while, if you, like, you know, and it's still blue. I don't normally like to shampoo right after I use semi-permanent dye, but I might, just so I know it's not going to stain my pillow too, too bad tonight. Body wash tried to take me out. All right. We're using Paul Blend. Paul, Paul Blend. The stuff my mom got me in my stocking. All right. That did something. I know it did. All right. Woo! I would have just gotten in the shower, but I made that bad decision this time last year using some blue and that was a catastrophe i was a smurf do not shower when you have to rinse out your hair dye it don't work you just turn blue or the color that's in your hair Ugh. yeah so we're just gonna chill we're just gonna chill for a minute while the conditioner sits in my hair for like 0.2 seconds and then we're gonna rinse it out and then we're gonna go put should I use this protein mask now? It's already 1.30, I may as well. Okay, we're gonna do a protein mask too. And then use my leave-in conditioner and shit. And then we'll see what we're left with when it's a little, a little bit drier. It's blue, but we knew that, so. Uh, that's enough time, eh? Oh my god, stand up straight for a hot second. Ooh. My ears are plugged. <laughs> the, the hair whip and the neck crack. All right. Damn, it's dark. Well, it'll be lighter when I dry it, but like. But just to give my hair a little treat, I'm gonna do a protein mask. I don't know, it was $5 at Walmart. It's called the Nutrifix Hair Reconstructor. Deeply hydrates and Deeply hydrates for critically damaged hair. Water, alcohol, silicone, vitamin E, citric acid. I don't know if it's actually good. Helps re-energize hard damaged hair, encourages thickness and volume, and building pores and liquid. Should I do a protein right after to fill in any other gaps and seal it in? Is that does that make sense? Whatever. Is that enough? I don't know. I'm not a professional. Did I say that yet? Just get some more in there. It's only five dollars. What the fuck is going on? Get it on every strand. We are coming out of quarantine, looking snatch. I forgot to do my eyebrows. Um, I can do my eyebrows while I like wait for this to sit. Right? Yeah. Ooh, she looking hella fun. All right. Do I think I have my whole head coated? If it can stay like that, yes, there's enough in. Oh no, not take off the gloves. Dry the gloves, eyebrow time. I love dyeing my eyebrows. So we're literally just gonna take, oh, we should really do the, that's what I mean, I'm trying to be a professional. Get that in the video. Put like Vaseline around it as if you're like carving them out with concealer. You know what I mean? It's just doing your eyebrows, but with semi-permanent dye. Y'all feel? Okay. All right, so we're just gonna start with whatever is left on the brush. See what we got. Okay, comb them down. Now, we're going to play itty bitty bitty bit amount. Itty bit, ooh. Itty bit. That's way more than an itty bit. We're just gonna lightly just drag it Drag it along the hairs so it's like just catching the hairs but not really like your skin. You're gonna rub it in anyway, but like whatever. Honestly, let's just go for it. Blue tinted eyebrows is gonna be a thing now. I'm just gonna stain the skin. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, just get it in there. Yeah. Just get it. Okay. Put that down. Face cloth. We're gonna like, I don't know. I don't really know what we're doing. Maybe our finger, like smudge it in a little bit. This is 
This is the fun of quarantine. Yeah. Okay, no panic. Oh. Nobody panic. Oh, that just pushed that up so hard. <laughs> And honestly, it'll wash off of your skin before it fades from your eyebrows. So like, if you fuck up, it's only gonna be there for like a week or so. And your hair's blue anyway. Not saying that you should do this. I think they're supposed to be, you know, it's an actual eyebrow. Not that's blue though. Are you fucking kidding me? I'm not still blonde. Not as blonde. Whatever. Okay, I'm gonna go let this all sit for like 15 minutes, watch some Netflix, rinse it all off, rinse it all out, dry my hair. Finally done for the night. I should have known starting my hair at like 11.30, I wasn't going to bed until like 3. That's just a reality. I don't know. Okay, gonna go watch Netflix now. Okay, this is it. Um, I'm in the bathroom so you can see better lighting. So, here it is. It's wet and I realize I packed my blow dryer so I can't blow dry it, but that's probably best for it anyway. I think I rinsed it pretty good. The protein mask feels good. I put my conditioner in. It looks so good. Oh, she back, bitches. Yeah, it just looks so much cleaner and like, I was looking like a crackhead before and the multicolors don't look good when they're fading and have them yellow like this one little patch back here i don't think it fully took so like whatever but i'll get it eventually anyway that's it mm, look at that i did like mm, yeah i did a pretty good job Roots aren't as blue as I want them to be, but they're pretty, they're good. They're good for now. And they look good with the, like in person, they look better. They look a little like yellow in this lighting, but no, I'm happy. There it is, update.